What's up, everybody? It's the Rogue in Disguise, North American community contributor for World of Warships Blitz. And if this is your first time here, well, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe, and turn that bell to all to catch all that we do for World of Warships Blitz. Oh, but yes, and today we got the beautiful dolphin out fishing. <laughs> Oh, but yes. And let's talk about this tier 9 Pan-Asian cruiser that's hitting the waters of World of Warships Blitz. Oh, but yes. Let's see if we can catch a nice fish. Ha <laughs> ha. What's up, everybody? So we're here to talk about the dolphin. And th this thing is just all types of interesting. So if you're not really familiar with it, you're going to be out here in World of Warship Splits here pretty shortly. If by the time you've seen this video, it's probably already out. So what can I tell you about this thing? Well, it's got 130 millimeter main guns. Take five seconds to reload them stock and can get the mod on there to get them a little bit faster. But keep them where, where they're at. They're fine just for a five second reload time. And you can tweak them out just a little bit to get them filled faster but work on the torpedoes and i'm going to explain to you why here in just a moment so in a sense of what's going on with this ship it's crazy with the long reach that it has on the weaponry because it has an 11 and a half kilometer range on these 130 millimeter guns with a five second reload time and you got a four and a half percent chance of setting a fire on right it's pretty decent well during my experience in that gameplay it's pretty quick fire i mean i wish it was a hair faster but like i said if i really wanted that i could tweak out its armament to do so but i think it's right where it's at five seconds is pretty good you know they're not very heavy hitting weapons but they do pretty well and they do set fires and it's a pretty good rate of fire to be just an annoyance ship now where the real real beauty of this ship lies into it is its torpedo armament and why the torpedo armament is so good is well simply for the fact that they've got almost a 10 and a half kilometer range right 10 and a half kilometer range man you could sit there and just be like set them and the torpedoes are fast as well at 67 knots well 66.69 knots if you want to be technical about it but almost 67 freaking knot torpedoes fast as fast as some of the european torpedoes but they're like 80 knots 70 knots they're zipping down the water so this one's doing pretty fast faster than your normal ign torpedoes which are at about 60 to 66 knots as well so fast torpedoes long range they can also be dumped pretty quickly i mean considering they got a 45 second reload time this thing is is going to disperse a lot of torpedoes in a short amount of time now now just to make it even worse just to make it even that much worse for this vessel and for your enemy well let me tell you what what makes this ship a lot worse is for the sit back 45 second reload time and it has torpedo reload one 90 second cooldown okay great two salvos of torpedoes and then every 90 seconds you can slap on another one because you're gonna get three charges of that so that's pretty damn good in my opinion right so that being said guys we've got quite an interesting ship long range torpedoes guns are very annoying -ish. they can set fires if you hit them long enough and hit them in the right spot you can do it and for a noob like myself who's played for the last four years and thousands and thousands of games if i can set a fire you guys can set fires the guys are real fire experts out there i'm telling you this boat can do it four and a half percent chance of setting a fire five second reload time a little mod if you want to do it get it down a little bit by five seconds or so or five percent or so but isn't that much difference in the long scheme of the game you want the range on the the torpedoes because they're going to just continuously dump and you can still torpedo these torpedoes too especially being a cruiser right because your surface detection is only seven and a half kilometers not bad at all after you tweak with it you could probably get it a little lower yeah i know you could probably get the dolphins surface detection a little lower you can't it's not that big of a deal what i have to say overall is well <sighs> The one thing I don't like about one particular camouflage is this one. It's like a dolphin. Great ship stats, great everything like that. Can do a lot of damage possibly if you stealth torp it out. It's got four charges, you know, smoke generator. I mean, good lord. But this is just one camouflage. I mean, the historical camouflage is not that bad. I mean, honestly, guys, the historical camouflage is, let's be realistic. I mean, the historical camouflage is not that bad. Different stats. And it's going to be really dependent on what you guys want to do as far as getting this stuff out, you know, and playing with it the way you want to and 
have fun with it. I mean, this camouflage is real nice. It does offer a lot, you know what I mean? The other one is more specific for what that is, and it's a look. You don't have to be known as the dolphin ship when out there, but those guys who get the dolphin camouflage, go ahead and do that. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. If you want it, get it. I, I, I've been making jokes about that thing for all day, and I, I think it's okay, it's growing on me a little bit. Okay, it's a little fun looking ship with the dolphin on. Okay. Some people are like, oh, it's an embarrassment. Why is it a dolphin? Oh my god, it's a dolphin. Who cares? Okay, it's something different. Good lord. I mean, this game has had some stagnanticity in this for a while. I mean, there's something to get us kind of going, hey, they can make a camo that makes it look like a dolphin. I wonder if they can make me look like a little baby shark. Do, 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 baby shark. Do, do, do. Or if I could get the camo to make it look like, you know, a grim reaper with a giant, you know, a grim reaper on the back of it with a giant scythe coming rolling through and just every time you sink a ship he just swings his scythe and laughs that would be kind of cool right that give me some real cool camo ideas what do you guys think if they can make a dolphin i know they can do anything right little time in artistry on it pg and e it frame it up in your blender or unity or unreal engine whatever the heck you guys are using i don't even know but i know it's one of those engines right so guys if you like this video man make sure you smash that like button you know how to do it oh but yes hit that subscribe and turn that bell to all to catch all that we do for world of warships blitz oh but yes i'm the rogue in disguise north american community contributor for world of warships blitz oh but yes and also to check out that beautiful link down below oh but yes check out that link down below in that link tree link and catch all our social media platforms oh but yes until the next video guys don't do anything i wouldn't do twice Just me and my canoe sailing to you. Don't piss me off or I'll send some torpedoes right after you. I think my dolphin habit's just getting a little bit out of control. What do you think? Just me and my canoe. It looks like a dolphin to you. Don't get in my way. I'm going to hit you with a torpedo. Anyway. Oh, yeah. Fishing it out. Do, 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 do. Just me. Me, me and my canoe. Yes, I can shoot things at you. Do 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 do